Praise Master Jesus. Praise Master Jesus. God is a good God. God is awesome God, yo. I'm not going to waste your time. I'm not going to waste your time, but I'm very, very sure that you will not regret watching this video. I just want you to just uh, look at this post. You see that post. That post was posted on Facebook. It was posted on Facebook concerning our Lord's prayer. Our Lord's prayer. And if you remember, our Lord's prayer was Jesus Christ teaching the disciples how to pray. And it was posted. But the so-called fast checkers, fast checkers, they took it down. Wow. What is... What is going on? What is going on? Why is devil really taking over? Why? Why? Yes, we know that we wrestle not against flesh and blood. We know that the device of the, 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 the enemy, the Satan, is so obvious everywhere. But we're not going to be tired. We're not going to get weak. Don't get weak. Don't be tired. I have a scripture that I want to read out to those that are really attacking the things of God. In the book of Luke chapter 4, if you go with me, Luke chapter 4, verse 12. And Jesus answering said unto, unto him, It is said, Thou shalt not tempt the Lord thy God. Jesus was saying this to Satan. It's a warning message. You fast checkers, you got to be very careful. You got to be very careful. No matter what the devil is doing on earth, there must be truth. There must be truth. And who is the truth? God himself. Satan cannot shut the truth. Satan cannot uh, uh, blow away the light of God. The light of God will always constantly keep on shining. The devil cannot stop it. Surely they shall gather. But if their gathering is not from God, God will definitely destroy the demonic activities. I know you are, you are like, wow, has it gotten to this, this level? <laughs> we need to pray. We need to stand firm. God love you. I just want to share this. It hurt my feelings. But uh, let's pray. Stand firm. God bless you, bye.